get anything less than a 10, we're gonna screw up because this took me fucking hours. Like, it's not much, but trust me, it's honest work. If you could see the mess I made in my room, just for this one little area to be presentable-ish. Bro, 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 bro. Mm -mm. There's a fucking yoga mat on my bed. Just for this one little area to look like decent-ish. And even then there's like garbage there. Also, don't say shit about my hair. I know this one's fucked up. Leave it be. What it do, bitches? Okay, that was a little aggressive for a first video, so... How is it going, my respectable people? As you see in the title, we're making jewelry. Get it? I've been seeing it pop up everywhere. I don't know why. I think it's kind of... Actually, I think it's kind of cool. I kind of fuck with it. I know a lot of people who don't, primarily guys, they be telling me, like, she looks ratchet as hell, and yeah, it is, but what are you gonna do? And honestly, that shit's dying out. Like, jeweling and all that, it's... It's dead. Like, it's 2020. Who's, who smokes anymore? Like, that's just fucking whack. Like, if you smoke, you're fucking whack. It's 2020. <coughs> oh, that got me. That, that got me tearing up. <coughs> but yeah, we don't. It's 2020. Stop jeweling. It's not healthy. And you're a fucking kid and you're doing it. What are you doing? Stop. And then I also feel like it's a good way to, like, not have people litter so much with their pods because that shit is bad for the environment i know damn well like going to school i see that shit everywhere i see people throwing away the caps on the floor just littering everywhere so i feel like it's a good way to recycle recycle upcycle but to like just pick up after yourselves and if you want to make some jewelry then pop off you know okay i've been talking way too much let's get into it the first thing you're gonna need are some pliers and you're going to use some eye pins or a wire, some jump rings, and a keychain ring. Then you're going to use some glitter. I'm using purple and green. They remind me of Tyler the Creator's aesthetic type of thing, you know? We're going to need some paint. Again, I'm using green and purple. And then, of course, you need a brush. Some clear nail polish, which you'll see what it's for later. Then, of course, we're going to need our dual pods. Shout out to my friend D, who gave me some, and my cousin's best friend, his cute ass friend, who supplied me with this, you know, get you a man's who could supply you, could provide you with shit. Oh my god, I'm just kidding. Like, if he ever sees this for some reason, he's gonna think I'm a fucking creep and, like, a weirdo, but, you know, shout out to him. Okay, anyway, back to- I'm gonna open up our pod, right? Ooh, this is nasty. Ooh, do you see that? That is dirty. Ugh, nasty. That's so the first thing we're gonna do is we open it. And this is kind of a hard process, especially if you got your nails did, like... Well, what you want to do is you want to go on the sides and you want to open it up. It's kind of hard. Okay, so I can't get... What is that noise? Oh, that's nasty. That's foul. You hear that noise? What am I doing with my hand? What the fuck? <laughs> so we finally popped it open, you know. Take out the filters. Hashtag no filter. Now you want to disassemble the pod to clean it out. And we want to get a napkin. Not sponsored by Chipotle, but if you guys want to send me like a chicken bowl, I'm cool with that. Look at all this nasty nasty. So after cleaning the top part, we're going to disassemble the jewel pod to clean it out even more. Next, we're going to take our wire and our pliers, make it into a loop, and this is what's going to make our pod jewelry into a charm. I don't really know how to explain it, but you see what I'm doing. Then after making the loop, we're going to cut it off and fit it through the cap. So now you want to take your Gorilla Glue that you stole from Home Depot because they really want to fire my cousin's best friend. Which, by the way, shout out to him. I'm wearing a sweater. Just a couple things, you know. No, no, no. He let him watch this video and, and think I'm a fucking creep. Like, no, I just, I fuck with this hoodie a lot because one, it's his. But two, it's just really comfortable. But And also, I didn't want to dress up super nice. Like, I spent a lot of time on my hair, so like... Don't expect much out of me. 
But yeah, they fired him at his job at Home Depot because he was like staining stuff. But like everybody be staining and they already account for shrinkage. So it's like, don't be rude. So I took a bunch of shit one day. Like I saw a bunch of stuff from like the one that he used to work at. Justice for Z 2019, almost 2020. Now that I'm done being a bad influence, we're going to take our Gorilla Goo, put a little bit on the wire, and then stick it into the rad part of the pod. Then we're going to snap it shut. Yeah, it's crooked, but... It's good because we're just going to cover up our mistakes. Something my mom couldn't do when she had me. Look at that. You got your own little charm, little cutie here. Now we can make it into a necklace, and you could even layer it up with other chains and stuff for that e-girl look. And the thing I love about jewelry is the fact that you could change the cat part of it. So it can match your your fit, your you know, your aesthetic, period. Also, peep my nails. Like it's been a month since I've edited this. I'm gonna show you two ways. One is the basic way, which you only need one jump ring for and an earring finding. You know, you don't wanna be too flashy with it. This one's just some simple. And look at that. Look at this little cutie. Oh, ee. Look how cute one little dangly thing and then the other if you want to be extra you're gonna need one of these you need like an, an extender and i'm gonna take it off the jump ring hold up we're gonna take this chain extension and attach it to our earring finding you can get this from any twisting machine from those you know those cheap low-key chains and we're gonna attach it to the jump ring on the loop of our pod charm bro <gasps> oh why did it do that why did it do that? Why did it come out? Oh my god. Why did it do that? Like... Why did it do that? Time to whip it back out. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm a mess, I'm a mess. This is karma from me stealing. Don't steal kids. I'm gonna say my shit, but don't, don't, don't reenact. Don't try at home. At this point, I'm not even using the other plier. Like, that's too much work. I'm just using my fingernails. Like, why is it not coming out? Oh, shit. I'm like sweating from how frustrated and tired. I and then we're just gonna, oh, okay. And we got it. Hey, okay. It's a little crooked still, but we got it. We got it. We, we finally got it. It's a little ugly if you look at the top, but don't look at the top then. Shit. I'm wasting so much glue, but good thing we didn't pay for it. Justice Brizzy 2020. 2019. Okay, so now we're done with our earrings. I showed you two different ways. One is the simple way. You know, it's cute. We fucking with it. Also, I don't have my ears pierced. Like, I know, I know, I know. I'm like old as fuck and I don't have my ears pierced but this is how it looks and I think it's pretty cute but let me show you something real quick you really want to pop off the extended one is where it's at like again ears not pierced but I think you we could all imagine it like look how cute this is if you want to take the extra step I will go for the extended chain like it's just it's just cute yeah so now we're gonna make a keychain I'm not gonna lie, this is gonna take a while. Like, there, it's a whole process, but trust me, it's cute. Oh shit. Here we go again. Worst place in the world. I don't know what's gonna break first, my nail or the whole fucking thing. <coughs> so after we redo the whole process, we're gonna take the cap. And then we're gonna choose a paint. I'm using green. You choose whatever color you want, but then you're gonna take a toothbrush. I mean, to ugh, paintbrush and some water. Then we're gonna layer it on thick because we want pigmented, you know, Jeffree Star shit. And then after that, we're gonna let it dry. While we're waiting for that to dry, bro, my fucking stomach. We gonna move on to the next step, which is putting the rod back into the pod and filling it up with glitter. Because I'm telling you, this is a whole process. We gotta let that paint dry. Now we're taking some glitter. One is more fine and the other is more chunkier because I like my pods to have a little bit of texture in it. And now I'm gonna make a funnel out of paper so that we could pour 
the glitter in. I'm taking the fine glitter first because I think it's a good base. We're just gonna pour it inside. Look how satisfying this is, like, after putting in the base of the fine glitter, I took the chunkier glitter and this is where I messed up with the chunkier glitter because it was just not going down. It was just, look at that, not, no. Yeah, no, I just took that shit and I did it the other way because it was just not going down that little hole. It even wasn't going down that well. It just kept pouring everywhere, so I just took the little wire and stuck it in even more. This is what you'll end up with. Now we're going to take the rubber stopper and cap off the glitter so that when we shake it, none of it comes out through the lid. So none of this happens. It's always better to like overestimate how much you need. This is how it's basically gonna be like. You know how fucking long the paint takes to dry? Like, that shit is still fucking drying. It's still drying after we did this whole thing. Like, um, okay. I guess we'll do another one. For this one, I'm going to use light purple, and again, you want to layer on the paint thick. We want it thick, thick, thick. And since that's going to take long to dry too, we're going to switch back to the green, get the sides and the back side of it. And yeah, since, you know, they're both going to take forever to dry, we're just going to keep switching back and forth. Now that both of them are painted, we're just going to let them dry, set it off to the side. Do not touch it. I swear to God, do not touch it. While we're waiting, we're going to move on to the second glitter part. Again, use a fine glitter as a base. And again, the chunky glitter, ooh, it does not want to get in. Like, I had to use my fingers this time. Just honestly, do whatever you can with it. Just try not to get your finger crust in it, you know what I mean? Like, I don't care what you gotta do. Rob a fucking bank, do whatever. Just get the glitter in there, cap it off, and you're done. Like, call it a day. The shit, oh my god. Whole process. Now that the green cap is finally dry, we're gonna take the clear nail polish from earlier and basically glaze it so that the paint doesn't chip off or anything. And also because it's shiny and cute, you know? You want to get all sides, and then you want to let it dry again, however long that takes. Like, I really have been waiting for, like, 20 minutes for that shit to dry. Just, like, one side. So when I tell you this is a whole process. Once that front side is dry, we're going to paint the back now. Then we're going to insert the loop that we made with the wire, put some glue, and snap it shut. The most satisfying part, because that means we're almost done. Could stop right there this next part is optional shit i mean the whole fucking video is optional to be honest like this like, who the fuck who the fuck we're gonna use some beads and some eye pins and you're gonna do basically like different designs with them put them through that eye pin most satisfying part did that sound gross because I feel like my spit was just, I was like salivating, you know what I mean? Like, I don't even know what, what the fuck that was. But yeah, put them through the loop, you know, play with the designs. I made another one off camera because this shit taking too long. Sorry. Then we're going to make a loop. We're going to cut it down and make a loop with it. And you're going to end up with these things. Sorry, I don't know what they're called. But now... You see what I'm doing. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm out of breath. Oh my god, like... I'm, like, literally out of breath because I feel like I'm breathing so much into, like, the the mic or whatever. So, you see what I'm doing. Like, I'm just using more jump rings to attach everything together and to the key rings. Which, again, you can get from Twisty Machines. That's where I get a lot of my shit from because I'm not trying to pay that much, you know? Now that we're done. finally done, time for the little montage.
what's up you guys so you know it's been a month as you can see like different nails and then that's also why i kept saying 2019 because it was still 2019 when i was recording so look at how outgrown this is like y'all saw in the video it was normal now it's like fucking but i just want to say a little update sorry this video took so long even though it's my first video so it's like you wouldn't even know how long it took but it's been a month no like i recorded that in december ridiculous and it's february now which by the way valentine's day video look out for it but um i just want to say um thanks for watching you know you better watch the whole thing because it took me forever to edit it but i also want to say that i'm gonna list the jewel pod keychains in my depop so check that out if you want it okay bye i like cash in my hair to my ass do the dash can you make it go fast